Hey y'all, it's Mary, and this is Mary Catherine Loves Cats, and this is Friday Night Gab, and Smudge is in a lovely mood, and I know he hasn't been on camera in a while, so I thought y'all might want to see him. I don't know if he'll turn his face. Lou was up here a minute ago, too, and he jumped down. Of course, you know, the camera goes on, he jumps down. Um, the other day, when I was done filming, one of them, it was blue. I'm blaming it on blue. <laughs> he jumped up here and got all tangled up in the, what my camera is my phone and it sits in the ring light and it fell to the floor and it's crashed and I have patched it together patched it back together so it's I think it's a little crooked so sorry guys <laughs> okay it's much it's, it's a little crooked but anyway anyway got it working anyway I have a few things to talk about so today is the big day if you are a FabFitFun member, if you're a FabFitFun annual member, today you should have picked your choices. You should have gone in and picked. And um, they have the refills and the add-ons and all that stuff. And y'all, have you noticed anything? Um, yesterday, actually, the shop opened for annuals and um, the pricing is just incredibly high. Everything's gone way up. Everything's gone way up. I got an email also um, saying that my I have a, a mystery bundle refill that I get that was $15.99 or $14.99. Smudge. Gee, great my lipstick, y'all. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, my goodness, Smudge. Um, that's going to $19.99, I think they said. And that is not a full-size mystery bundle. It is a three-piece mystery bundle. And some people, last last season, some people got an unhide blanket in that bundle. And I got, I don't even remember what I got, it was so bad. I got, um, I know um, a couple of times now in that little refill I've gotten like barrettes. Not real happy with that. So I have canceled it and then last month I uh, put it back on because I thought, well, $15. It gives me nice gifts to put in giveaways. Um, but now, the regular sized mystery bundle is $39, y'all. Y'all, $29 was rough for me to have to buy that every month and then ship y'all out a, I have plenty of stuff to give away, but the shipping to send something out, um, if I, depending on the size of, it could be $20 to ship it out. So um, I did talk with Johanna from JM Unboxing and More about it and said that I really couldn't do that monthly to have a battle monthly anymore. We've done it for 20, 20, not exactly 20 months in a row because I think we've taken off in the past around Christmas. I know this time we did. I think last year we might have. Mostly we've done it every month and it's gotten quite expensive. So um, we were gonna do two to three months you know, 10 weeks, somewhere in there. I have two mystery bundles, so so um, we won't have to worry about it right now. We'll see what happens, because maybe if people complain enough, they will lower those prices, I don't know. But I don't know about the future of my battles, and I'm pretty upset about it. So, but please go see, I do have a battle going right now with, with Johanna from JM Unboxing and More, and um, uh, that is the FabFitFun mystery bundle battle. And of course, y'all here lately in all of my videos where I have a, um, a giveaway. I keep forgetting to tell you all like a word to say for the comment picker. So I'll enter everybody. And if I, if you win and I contact you and you just wanted to be there for support or something that you can tell me, and then I will pick another winner. Okay. So I'm sorry that I keep forgetting. It seems like I've been, I've had so much on my mind lately about my house, but that's coming along well. Um, the, uh, I think, did I tell y'all, I know I told y'all some about it, um, last Saturday cause I was so excited. Um, I did get several different names from people that people that know other people. And um, um, this, uh, I've talked with a couple of them, but this one particular gentleman actually came to my house and looked at, the, at what needed to be done. And he's already done some of the work. He and his crew, he's an older gentleman, and then he has a crew of, of people. And his company name is, it's a, is Roofing. So I didn't know that he would do any more than roofing, but he he's gonna do, what it is is I have a leak in my roof. I wasn't sure what, we weren't sure what it was because they don't, they, uh, a quick glance, there was no trouble on the roof. 
So um, he tells me my roof is in, in great shape. It has a lot of years left to it, so that's good. There were uh, misplaced nails and one rusted. And then there was, um, you know, that there's a, uh, it's, I'm giving you too much information. Anyway, there were a couple of leaks up there. So they've patched those and they've looked in my attic and um, my insulation is good. And now inside my bedroom, uh, one of my bedrooms, the drywall needs replacing. If I remember, I'll put the picture of that at the end, what that looks like. And that happened, we had, um, we've had a lot of wind and a lot of rain. In fact, we're still in all that now. Um, it's just, it's like, it's like winter has come back. So, um, you know, our lovely, uh, um, groundhog says winter is going to be here longer. <laughs> so I think he said that last year too. Anyway, I think he says it every year, but, <laughs> but anyway, um, um, just the wind and the rain and some got in. So, um, and it, I'm just so happy that I have this person and his company working um, working on it because he really knows what he's doing. They know what they're doing and I'm I'm very proud to have them here. So that is going on. And um, I did have um, a coworker tell me this week I've been freezing. I've been freezing all week. <laughs> the weather is different here. It's been in the 40s for our high, like 40, 41, 42. And it's always very humid here. So that feels bone chilling, like you're like teeth chattering cold. <laughs> and in Chicago, when it's cold, or in Chicago, it's just drier, you know, every day. It's just drier. And yes, there are humid days in the summertime, but um, <clears throat> it's just drier <laughs> in the wintertime. I'm laughing about it because he said he's from Chicago also as a kid. He lived there. And he said, he said, Mary, I think you, you lost your Chicago card. So, you know, guys say that to each other about you lost your man card and stuff like that. It just cracked me up um, because I was like, oh, I'm cold. I'm cold. <laughs> so where they, um, I, my office is, I, we have a really big building and I'm on one side of the building where it's nice and warm or mostly nice and warm. And then in the mornings, I have to often go to where they're loading things and the doors are open. So I just, you know, been freezing. So, and that's, and he said that to me. So I just thought that was really funny. Um, so um, I hope that have y'all, I hope y'all, what'd you think of FabFitFun? Did you get what you wanted? Um, you know, I'm always, excuse me, I still have fur around my face from smudge. Um, it's not, uh, FabFitFun has not been my favorite for a while. Um, but when I actually get it, and also when I see other channels open and they get different things from me, I really like the things. So, um, but when I see them all together, I'm like, Ugh, you know, and inevitably I always like two or three items from one grouping and maybe nothing from another grouping. So, but it, it works out in the end. Um, also, um, I, oh, I wanted, wanted to show y'all, um, some of y'all were asking me about a couple of products that I've received recently. So this, it, I have this lippy on. This is what I got. There's fur all over this. <laughs> um, the Honest Beauty that I got in the $5 Ipsy with this and a little, a little mini um, lippy that I haven't tried yet. This um, is uh, more of a, it looked to me more of a, um, what am I trying to say? Like a plum, like a, well, that's not what I'm trying to say. But anyway, what's, what's the name of it? Um, I have it on now. And um, it's called Marcella. So that's like a, that's a, a, Marcella is a wine, a red, a reddish wine, right? So anyway, to me, it's a little more nude than plum. And sometimes it looks plummy and sometimes it looks nude. It's one of those weird things. So it just depends what light I'm in. But I do, but regardless of that, I, this is really, really nice. Um, it is, it feels really good on my lips. It's very moisturizing. It's not, it's not tacky at all. I don't like tacky. That's why I like bullet lips, lipsticks more than glosses. I do like some glosses. <clears throat> if I have a bullet lipstick that's a little dry, I'll put a gloss on, but I don't want it to be tacky. I don't want my lips to stick together, you know? And um, I don't like my lips to be really wet because then fur gets on them. So, but anyway, that is the Honest Beauty. And this was a full size. And this, I think, is valued at only only twelve ninety nine. Um, I think you can get Honest Beauty at the drugstores, right? But this came with a little lippy, and the two together were five dollars. And then I got this in my Walmart box. 
This is from CoverGirl. Really pretty packaging. It's called Lash Plumping Mascara. And it's supposed to be a primer and a lash a mascara all in one. Well, I have it on. Now, I know that you guys, because of, you know, I don't, I don't film right on my face like a makeup artist would. Um, you don't necessarily see my eyelashes so much. <clears throat> but this is nothing special. It's just like mascara. I like the brush. The brush is different. You see that it's got a bit of a curve to it. And it has um, like a point. You know, this side is just straight flat. And then it has that bend to it. I do like that. The brush is different. But it isn't lengthening to me at all. And um, it's just like regular old mascara to me. I didn't see anything special about it. I will use it for the three months. And then I'll be done with it. Um, but yeah, nothing spectacular. I have more spectacular mascaras out there. Um, and I think that was really about, oh, I want to tell you also, no, sh I'm, I don't know how to say it right, but I think it's Nashery. Um, I am talking with them back and forth. I so, I'm so sorry about the fur in my face. <laughs> and, um, they just started like in November. I think I told you that already. They're an app for, for an iPhone, for an iPad. They don't have, um, Android yet. I'm hoping that they will in the future. I'm asking them about that. Um, they are behind because they're overwhelmed with the success of their app. It's doing really well. So I know that a lot of y'all signed up under me and I appreciate that so much. I um, got a fabulous box from them that I will be showing sometime in this week coming up. Um, because if you, if, if five people sign up under you, you get a a box filled with full-size items. Um, three full-size items, I think it is. Normally we get samples, although in my sample packages, I think every sample package I've got so far, I've had some full-size items. So um, it's all snacks, I, I forgot to tell you that. Snacks and drinks, wonderful stuff. Very exciting to get it, lots of fun. And um, they just are asking, please be patient with them. Because um, I um, when I go in to the app to do I try to do it every day because if you do it every day, what they do is they show you snacks and then you say yes or no, you'd like them. And then you progress to another day. And then when you have seven days built up, you get to have a box. So I like to do that. You know, I want I want to get my free box. Um, but lately it's not been working well for me and they're just so nice and they're really working hard on it. And they said part of the problem is, is they're out of snacks. Now this was, this was a, earlier in the week. They have since gotten some things in. So be patient with them. They're working on all that. And um, don't worry, um, they do keep it, you know, you, you can see a track. Like I have a few boxes out there that I haven't been able to fulfill yet. Um, so when they open that up, then they will be able to fulfill, you know, when they get more snacks in. So um, they have told me they're a small company. So we just need to be patient with them and they will honor everything. And they're just super nice people, so. Um, and I think that's, re oh, I did want to have something else. This is getting longer than I thought, y'all. I'm sorry. I want to know, <laughs> I want to know from every one of you that go to Starbucks, what the heck? I am a person that always went to Starbucks. Not every single day, no. But before COVID, before COVID, I would go to Starbucks two, three, four times a week. Seriously. Every morning I would drive and, and, and then, I mean, for a long time too. God only knows how much money I've spent with them. Um, and I do have fabulous coffee machines. I've always buy myself fabulous coffee machines because I'm so, I want my cappuccino. I want my lattes. Um, and I did a few years ago, I got, I've had several different machines and then, you know, they last a year or two and then they break. Um, but this last machine I've had, I've had maybe two years now and it's still working great. And um, I've just been, spending my money at home, so to speak, keeping my money at home, buying my espresso um, beans and making my own. So, and since, especially since COVID. And when I used to go, it would be $3, maybe five to $6 if I got um, something else, a croissant or something, okay? Somebody gave me a gift card to Starbucks, a $15 gift card. So I thought, okay, oh, that'll get me. You know, I'm thinking three visits. Oh no, 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 no. 
I got a, um, they, right now, what they're, uh, what they're having right now is pistachio. And I, I love their pistachio um, cappuccino or latte. I love it. I've had it in the past. It's very delicious. And I got one of those. And I did get the big one. I got the venti. And I got a hot one. Um, a latte, I believe it was. And I also got a slice. It's it's a, um, you know, like a, a banana bread, but it's a slice. Um, so, and my bill was $11.25. I about fell over. <laughs> I about fell over. I still have a couple dollars left on that gift card, but still, how do y'all afford that? I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. Can't do it. If I didn't have the gift card, it wouldn't have happened. But I want to ask y'all about that um, because no, um, with all just right there, if I was to do that every day, within within a couple of weeks, you could buy yourself a a really nice machine. If you need any help figuring out what machines to buy, ask me. Okay, because there's some that are really hard to operate, and there's some that are really easy to operate. Okay, last. But not least, um, let's talk about my giveaways. I always have giveaways going on. The Whisk F bags. I finally heard from everybody. Um, I had to. I had. Five, I drew five names. I only heard from two people. I drew three more names, and I heard from all three of those people. So um, that is done, and um, uh, everybody's excited about it. And I'm excited for you, the people that won. And um, also my. Um, Fat Fit Fun Mystery Bundle Battle with Johanna is going on still, so go see that if you haven't seen that yet. You watch her video, you watch my video, you decide who has a better bundle. And um, for a while there, we were neck and neck, and um, sort of, and then I think that the scales have tipped in Johanna's favor. And we both got really nice bundles, so um, that happens sometimes. At least we're, I think we're both happy with our bundles, which is good. I may not use everything in my bundle, but I'm, I, I think it was, I had got some good stuff, I feel. And I, and Johanna feels the same way. So that's most important to me than getting, you know, junk. Um, cause some, cause some bundles are not nice. Some bundles we don't like. And then, um, I have the treasure trove giveaway that is ending February 8th, but then it continues again and I'll give you an end date. I've been giving you end dates now. Now I'm starting from now on, I'll be giving you an end date because I do bonuses, um, You'll see bonuses in different videos. And if you if you win the treasure trove, you win. You win what you chose, one, two, or three. If you know what any of the bonuses are, you win them as well. If you don't know any bonuses, don't worry, you still win the treasure trove. But it's nice to win some bonuses, isn't it? So to win the bonuses, you have to know what they are. So um, you have to watch other videos. And um, I will... Um, explain more of that when I do the treasure trove giveaway again. But if you are keeping track of the bonuses, if you are new to my channel and did not know what the bonuses were, but like I said, do write them down because um, you may, if you win the treasure trove, you may need that list. So that is it, I believe. And y'all, thanks for stopping by. Count your blessings. Have a wonderful Friday evening. Have a beautiful weekend. I hope everybody's weather is okay. Oh my goodness, this weather, y'all. Six, I think it's going to be 60 more weeks of winter is what it feels like. It's like never ending, never ending. I haven't seen the sun in forever, y'all. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for stopping by. Love y'all and count your blessings. Bye-bye.